Welcome to our exploration of the most common house spiders found in North America. House spiders are an integral part of our ecosystem, helping to control other pest populations. These eight-legged creatures, while often feared, play a crucial role in controlling pest populations. Let's dive into the fascinating world of house spiders and learn more about their habits, appearance, and impact on our homes. While most are harmless, it's essential to be aware of the few that can pose health risks. Understanding these common house spiders can help you coexist peacefully with these fascinating creatures. The American House Spider, also known as the Common House Spider, is a frequent guest in homes across North America. These spiders are small, usually about the size of a nickel, and have a round abdomen. Their color ranges from gray to brown with some white markings. They love dark, concealed areas like corners, basements, and garages, where they spin their tangled, messy webs to catch insects like flies and mosquito. Southern House Spider Southern House Spiders are often mistaken for other spiders due to their appearance. Females have round, dark bodies that can resemble small tarantulas, while males have a distinctive violin-shaped marking that can be confused with the brown recluse spider. Despite their somewhat intimidating look, these spiders are harmless and prefer to stay out of sight in dark, undisturbed places like shutters, window sills, and under stone. The domestic house spider is another common arachnid that shares living spaces with humans. These spiders are typically brown with pale or black stripes and prefer dark, dry crevices within homes. They're often found in cupboards, behind furniture, and in attics and basements. While they can bite if threatened, their bites are generally not dangerous causing only mild pain, itching, and swelling. Cellar spiders, often called daddy longlegs, come in both short body and long body varieties. These spiders are known for their incredibly long, thin legs and are often found in dark, moist environments like basements and garages. Despite their scary appearance and urban legends, cellar spiders are harmless to humans. They can't even pierce human skin with their jaw. Jumping spiders, from the family Salticity, are fascinating for their exceptional jumping ability and keen vision. These compact spiders are usually black, but can also be tan, gray, or brown, often adorned with colorful markings. They are active during the day and prefer to hunt their prey by jumping on them rather than spinning webs. Their excellent vision allows them to detect movement up to 18 inches away. The brown recluse spider is one of the few spiders in North America whose bite can cause significant harm. Identifiable by a violin shaped marking on its back, this spider prefers undisturbed areas like basements, closets, and sheds. While bites are rare, they can cause serious damage to the skin and tissues, so it's important to seek medical attention if you suspect a brown recluse bite. Wolf spiders are robust and agile hunters that don't rely on webs to catch their prey. Instead, they chase down their victims. These spiders are usually brown with a distinctive pattern on their backs and are often found in basements, garages, and around windows. While their appearance can be startling, Wolf spiders are not aggressive and their bites are not dangerous to human. Old weavers, from the family Araneidae, are known for their intricate, spiraling webs. These spiders vary greatly in color, shape, and size, and are often found in gardens, around porch lights, and under eaves. Their webs are a marvel of natural engineering, designed to efficiently capture flying insects. Old weavers are not harmful to humans and are beneficial for controlling pest population. Grass spiders, also known as funnel web spiders, build dense, silk lined webs to trap their prey. These spiders are often yellow, brown, or cream colored with dark bands running across their bodies. They are common in grassy areas and around windowsills. Grass spiders are shy and not aggressive, and their bites are not harmful to human. Hobo spiders have a reputation for being aggressive, but this is largely unfounded. They have an oblong abdomen and are often found in moist, dark areas like basements and garages. While they will bite if provoked, their bites typically cause only mild pain and redness. The hobo spider has been removed from the CDC's list of dangerous spider. While the thought of spiders might make your skin crawl, most house spiders in North America are harmless and even helpful in controlling other pests. So next time you see a spider in your home, remember that they're just doing their part to keep the insect population in check. If you really can't stand their company, there are plenty of humane ways to encourage them to move along without causing harm.